Welcome to the Rising 9th Grade Academic Advising presentation. Before we get started, please listen to a welcome message from your future principal, Dr. Nichols. Welcome to Stonewall Jackson High School. We are excited to welcome you to our Raider family. As you begin your time at Stonewall Jackson High School, I encourage you to take advantage of all the academic, athletic, and club opportunities that are available to you. Enjoy the remainder of your middle school career, and I look forward to seeing you at Stonewall in the fall. The purpose of this presentation is to provide you with information that will help you through the course selection process. We will discuss the graduation requirements for your freshman class, and we will go over important aspects of the academic advising process. Then we will introduce you to our counseling department and the current course offerings at Stonewall, including both core and elective classes. We will conclude with a list of important dates. There are two types of diplomas recognized in the state of Virginia, standard and advanced studies. An advanced studies diploma is ideal for college bound students because it shows the college admissions committee that you have taken a challenging course load. However, you need to consider your individual strengths and interests along with your post graduation goals to determine which diploma type makes the most sense for you. If you choose to pursue a standard diploma, you will need to complete a minimum of 22 credits. This includes four credits of English and three credits each of math, science, and social studies. You will also need to take two credits of health and physical education, one credit of economics and personal finance, two sequential elective credits of world language, fine arts, or career and technical education, and four additional electives. If you choose to pursue an advanced studies diploma, you will need to complete a minimum of 26 credits. You are required to take four credits each of English, math, science, and social studies. Additionally, you must take a world language. This can be three years of one language or two years of one language and two years of another. For example, two years of Spanish and two years of French. The remaining course requirements include two credits of health and physical education, one credit of economics and personal finance, one credit of a fine art or CTE, and three credits of additional electives. For both diploma types, you may receive high school credit for certain math and world language courses taken in middle school. These can be counted towards your graduation requirements. The standardized test requirements are the same for both diploma types. You must take and pass one social studies, one math, and one science SOL, and both your English reading and English writing SOLs. In addition, all students will need to have a CTE credential or pass an advanced course. An opportunity to earn a CTE credential will be provided through many of our CTE classes, as well as through economics and personal finance. Regarding advanced level course options, Stonewall offers several IB and AP level courses from which you can choose, as long as you meet the prerequisites for those courses. The virtual course will be embedded in the Economics and Personal Finance class. The CPR AED first aid training will be given in the Health and Physical Education 1 class during ninth grade. Now that we have reviewed the graduation requirements, let's go over the process for selecting your courses. The purpose of academic advising is to help you choose courses based on your academic and career goals, personal skills, and interests. After today's presentation, you will receive a scheduling packet with a sample course request form. Use this form to create a draft course request and bring it with you when we visit your school in the coming weeks. We encourage you to speak with your teachers, as well as your parents or guardians, about your course selections so you choose classes that are both appropriate for your skill level and will be of interest to you. In the coming weeks, we will visit your school to advise you as you make your course selections. At that time, you will take a copy of your request home to review with your parent or guardian and return a signed copy to your middle school counselor. During the spring, you will have the opportunity to review your course requests for accuracy. If you need to make changes, please submit those to your middle school counselor before the last day of school or mail it to Stonewall Jackson High School by June 30th. Your final schedule will be mailed to you prior to the start of the school year. 
When we visit your school for academic advising, your high school counselors will assist you with making course selections. Your counselor is assigned to you based on your last name. There will also be advisors available from the Special Education and English Language Learner Departments to assist with appropriate course selection. Now we will review your course selection options. You will choose a course from each of the course subjects, which includes English, Social Studies, Mathematics, Science, and Health and Physical Education. There are various course options available within each course subject for students to take based on skill set and personal needs. Two electives will be chosen from courses offered by the World Languages, Business, Family and Consumer Sciences, Technical Education, and Fine Arts Departments. You may also apply to take courses with the Air Force Junior ROTC and International Baccalaureate programs. Please note that ninth grade students are eligible to take pre-IB level courses. These courses are more challenging and rigorous than standard level courses. They are best suited for students who are taking extended or honors level courses or earn A's and B pluses in standard level courses in middle school. All students who request to take one or more pre-IB courses must submit an IB application, which is available online and due by February 1st. All ninth grade students will choose a total of seven courses and an additional two alternate electives in case classes fill up and you cannot enroll in your first choice. As you make your course selections, Keep in mind that some courses have prerequisite courses and minimum grade requirements. Course descriptions and requirements are listed within the Prince William County Schools course catalog, which are available online at stonewallhs.pwcs.edu. If you need a hard copy of the catalog, please speak with your school counselor. At this time, we will walk you through examples of a standard diploma academic plan and an advanced diploma academic plan. This slide shows an example of a standard diploma academic plan. This is only a sample. Your academic plan will vary depending on your needs. During ninth grade, students pursuing this diploma will select an English, math, science, and social studies course based on skill level. You will also choose health and PE1 and two electives. In addition, you will pick alternative elective courses, which will be placed in your schedule should your preferred choice be full or canceled. For this diploma, social studies is not required in 10th grade. However, students can elect to take world history too. This slide shows an example of an advanced studies diploma academic plan. This is only a sample your academic plan will vary based on your needs. During ninth grade, students pursuing this diploma will select an English, math, science, and social studies course based on skill level. It is highly recommended that you begin your world language courses at this time if you have not done so already. You will also choose health and PE1 and one elective. In addition, you will pick alternate elective courses, which will be placed in your schedule should your preferred choice be full or canceled. It is important to note that Algebra 1 Part 1 is considered an elective course and does not count toward the math requirement. If you are pursuing an advanced studies diploma and take Algebra 1 Part 1 during ninth grade, you will need to take an additional math class during summer school, night school, or virtual school to fit all four math credits into your academic plan. Please remember course requests are not guaranteed and schedules may need to be adjusted. In your registration packet, you will be receiving a letter to take home to your parent or guardian that provides an overview of today's presentation. On the back of the letter is a sample course selection form. Please work with your middle school counselor, teachers, and parents or guardians to complete this form and then bring it with you when we visit your school for academic advising. This will help your high school counselor complete your official course request form. The form is grouped together by subject and only includes courses available to ninth grade students. Remember, this is just a draft. 
If you are unsure of what level or section you belong in, we will be here to assist you during your school's academic advising session. Included in your packet is a description of the elective courses available to you. You can also find the complete Prince William County Schools course catalog at stonewallhs.pwcs.edu. We will look at end of course grades, SOL scores, teacher recommendations, and other assessment data to determine correct placement for core subject courses and make the appropriate adjustments over the summer. If you are currently taking a world language as an 8th grader, you will want to register for the next level in the sequence. Our world language department may come to your middle school to assess appropriate placement for the Spanish for Fluent Speakers course sequence. As we mentioned before, it is important to note that as a part of our math department, we offer Algebra 1 Part 1. This class is an option for students who may need more time and support in preparation for Algebra 1. However, this class is an elective and does not count towards the math requirement. These are important dates to keep in mind during the academic advising process. Take a moment to see which date our counselors and other academic advisors will be visiting your school for academic advising. The deadline to apply for specialty programs is February 1st. We are hosting an open house at Stonewall Jackson High School the night of April 4th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Please note the last day to submit schedule request changes is June 30th. Concludes today's presentation. We hope you now have a better understanding of the academic advising process. On behalf of the Stonewall Jackson High School Counseling Department, best of luck as you finish your middle school career and we look forward to welcoming you to our Raider community in the fall.